tree is growing in the clouds. Well, that must be something special. You come to a room with no ceiling that is opened to the sky. Though the ground still looks like clouds, there are islands of dirt piled up with trees growing out of each one. Air genasi flit between the branches from tree to tree, harvesting the fruit. That is, until they see you, of course. The giant's garden is a strange place. Though the ground still looks like it is made out of clouds, there are small islands of dirt about ten feet across dispersed throughout this garden area. Out of each pile is a large tree that seems to be growing, and there are air genasi flying around the area. There are six genasi in total, and as soon as they see the party, they begin to attack. For simplicity, we're using the Colt Fanatic and the Thean Warrior stat block, but altering them to give each of them a 40-foot fly speed. The melee types will fly in and attack, trying to take advantage of their pack tactics as much as possible. The ones using the Colt Fanatic stat block will either cast Shield of Faith on one of the Genasi that went in to fight in melee, or hold Person on a player if a Colt Fanatic doesn't already have advantage from pack tactics. On later turns, the Colt Fanatics can cast Spiritual Weapon to assist in the melee combat, or whatever other spell may be useful at that point in the battle. After the battle is over, the party discovers that the fruit from the trees is magical. The fruit from each of the trees can either be used as a healing potion or as a potion of flying. However, the magic of the trees and the fruit only lasts for one hour after the fruit has been picked. Tomorrow we see an encounter with the cloud giant himself. So hit that subscribe button and come back and check that out tomorrow. And you can also check out more videos in this playlist for more encounters in the Mega Dungeon.